Hey, how's it going, YouTube and Salad Master family? My name is Jesus Alvarez, and this is my son, Caden. And happy Thanksgiving. Welcome to Jesus' Cooking Channel. We are going to be making a delicious honey lemon garlic turkey today. It's going to be very, very simple. Stay tuned. So we're going to be doing a 22 pound turkey right on top of the stove with the 16 quart and salad master. Now what we're going to do instead of, I don't do no stuffing, but we are going to stuff this turkey and what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and stuff it with the pineapple. So son, if you can get one of our salad master knives, he's going to go ahead and start cutting, cutting the pineapple. So. Okay, so now that we have the pineapple cut, we're gonna place it inside the turkey. Hey Dad, can you grab the Salad Master 16 quart? Yep. Salad Master at its finest. I got the 16 quart right here. Sometimes when I wanna take a nice bubble bath, just open this up, make it nice and warm. No, I'm just joking, but this is an amazing, amazing piece. It's been around, this is my sister's, it's been around for about 13, a little over 13 years I've had this, so, or she's had this, so. We're gonna go ahead and use this tonight for our 22 pound turkey that we're gonna do right in here, okay? Uh, what's awesome about this pan is that it is very, very, big and allows us to voila uh, comes with detachable handles which is cool voila so if I wanted to do the turkey in here or whatever I could also bake it in the oven but it doesn't matter since it's 316 a surgical steel what we can go ahead and do is bake the whole 22 pound turkey inside here for about three and a half hours and we're gonna do that today right here right now you guys all right, first things first. So since we already got our pineapple stuffed, right? I'm gonna go ahead and get two cans of pineapples, just so we can get that juice and moisture on the bottom. And what's gonna happen is that these is gonna marinate as it cooks uh, on the bottom of the pan. All the natural juices are gonna fall down, but what we're gonna do as well is we're going to make sure when we place it in that our breast is facing down because that's what's going to cook up more and what's going to marinate so it doesn't make sense to put it on its back when there's no meat back there so all the meat face down i'm going to grab it like this pounds. boom this is in bada bing bada bang okay Next thing we'll I'll have my son do is I'll have him put some honey and all the ingredients that we need for the honey lemon garlic uh, turkey. But I'm gonna have him first chop up some lemon. What was that? Okay, now that my lemons are cut, we're gonna add them to the turkey. When you guys do this, you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you put one or two slices underneath the wings, so that way it marinates. Good job, son. So now that Caden has sliced the lemons and placed the lemons on our turkey, I need a lemon or two so that way I can slice it down the middle and add the lemon juice to our turkey. But first I need a lemon, son. Beautiful. Oh yeah. Orale. Look at that, beautiful. So the next ingredient is garlic. Now garlic can be very tricky in order to peel. Now the key trick in garlic is getting one tooth, right? Grabbing your knife and hitting it down so it smashes. That way when you peel it open, it's easier to peel. See how easy that is? Bada bing, bada bang. That's your 
that's the trick to do that. So what I'm gonna do is do the whole garlic one by one. So now that I have these all nice and peeled, I'm gonna go to add these nice garlic cloves. Can you see this? Oh yeah. Bada bang, bada bang. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit of Can you open that for Thank me, you. son? So you wanna go ahead and add a little bit of garlic salt because we're gonna go ahead and add about a tablespoon of salt. And then you can go ahead and add as much as you want. I usually do about, I don't know, tablespoon, no, about a, two tablespoons. And then, if you can look at that, doesn't that look amazing? I use garlic cloves too. And this is about a tablespoon as well. Don't want to use too much. They use a lot of this though for uh, for uh, desserts and stuff like that. And since we're using honey and uh, pineapples, it's gonna it's gonna accommodate the flavors of it. And then I'll have my son do the final touch, which is the honey. Thanks, Dad. Now we're gonna go ahead and add 32 ounces of honey onto the turkey. So now we can go ahead and do that. That look amazing. Now we're gonna turn it to medium quick. Thank you, son. He's doing an amazing job with me. Whoa, this is pretty heavy. So we're gonna go ahead and put it on medium quick low, as Caden said, and we're gonna go ahead and do it for about three and a half hours. Once you hear the little valve start to click, you turn it down to low, and that's when the timing starts. So medium click. Low, no pot watching, no stirring, no nothing. It's easy as that. Thanks, all. I'm asking to see you in three and a half hours. Okay, so it's been three and a half hours afterwards. We're gonna get this bad boy 22 pounds of amazingness, you guys. Let me grab this right here. Oh, look at that. This is so juicy, so amazing. Can you see that? Look at that. Okay, I had drain some of the uh, natural juices in it so that my sister can go ahead and make some homemade gravy. Uh, what I'm going to do is get these tongs right here. This is so good and so moist that it's actually gonna fall from the bone, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you this and then afterwards we'll go ahead and take pictures and show you how, how it looks like. So we'll go ahead and do that real quick. And if you can see, look how this just falls from the bone. Look at that. If I grab the... That bird. Got another one right here. Just like that. So, I'm telling you guys right now, presentation is not gonna look all fancy or whatever, but let me tell you, meat does fall from the bone. Tastes so good, so juicy, just melts in your mouth. Swallow it down with pride, you guys. So, uh, you guys have a good Thanksgiving, but first I want to go ahead and, and invite Richie and Shyla, my kids, they're here for the holidays. Come say ha happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving and thank you, Salad Master!